A new team with a spectacular view of the Cambria Cavern. Five structural engineers found even more space when they descended below. This cave stretches 200 feet, an extra 30 feet farther than originally thought. Crews are trying to figure out if the rest of the cave is stable. Structural engineers will continue to work with hydrogeologists who may go back down into the cave to get some more measurements. Neighbors are getting antsy. I was under the impression it would be today, and I've been putting off other plans in my life to be here because I don't want to miss when they come knocking on the door with some information. Like how close the cave is to Michelle Mitchell's home. I would be anxious if I found out that there was only about you know, 10 inches between me and the opening of the cave or the, you know, the ceiling of the cave. The county says when utility lines were installed 30 years ago, it weakened part of the cave ceiling, which may have caused the collapse. It was just that area that appears to be affected, but that's all that we know. And so we're telling the homeowners that they really need to make their own individual decisions right now. Decisions on whether to stay or go. Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News.